The first product on our list is Channel Master CM7777 HD. Cut the tiling and distortion from over the air television stations with the all weather Channel Master CM7777 HD, which is packed with features like adjustable amplification strength and smartphone signal interference blocking. The price is around $89. Check out the product link in the YouTube description below. This product is rated with 3.7 stars from 307 customer reviews, a customer said. It's a little pricey but I think worth it especially with the built-in filter. All of my channels are solid now. My setup has two antennas through a combiner down to one signal and then running through this. I now get all the channels available in my area and the channels are solid as a rock. I tried another booster and it didn't do anything so I decided to spend extra money and get this one and I'm glad I did. The next product on our list is WineGuard LNA200. Eliminate ghosting and dropout by strengthening over the air signals with the WineGuard LNA200. This selection features the manufacturer's Boost Clear Circuit technology, which helps cut down on the extraneous noise that sometimes comes along with amplification. The price approximately $42. The average rating of this product is 3.6 stars with more than 2,363 customer reviews, a customer said. We were having trouble with over-the-air TV. There is a big ridge between us and the public TV station, which my wife loves. Using a high gain antenna 20 feet up got public TV pretty well but lost the station that shows movies with Vincent Price and Godzilla and big rubber suited monsters. Going up to a 28 foot mast didn't solve the problem. But this Weingard masthead amplifier, put up on the mast only a foot from the antenna so the weak signals are amplified before the long run of cable down to the TV, solved the problem neatly and easily. Simple too. Another happy customer said. Updated, replacement unit did work and was stable, I totally forgot to update this after new unit was replaced and installed. I'm happy with what it does and then it has to a channel master 8 way for distribution. Do you need it? Not really, but it can add a few more channels and clean up some fringes. If you can afford to add it she'll work like a champ. This review is for the LNA200 Boost XT only. After reading the reviews on Amazon and on some other sites, I decided to give this a try. My current HD antenna is currently pulling. The next product in our list is RCA TV Pramp 1Z. If you live in the boonies and only get two or three grainy channels, you will appreciate the RCA TV PRAMP 1Z. Mount it onto your existing outdoor antenna to see a marked decrease in static and possibly discover new channels from far away broadcast towers. This product is available on Amazon for $38. This product is rated with 3.5 stars from 1538 customer reviews, a customer said. I could not wait any longer to say bye-bye to the ever-increasing and costly cable company, TWC, who, if they do not change their ways, will soon be out of business. I gave back their cable box long ago in favor of a TiVo Romeo. Best thing ever. How can you complain about a DVR with all the bells and whistles for half the price of the cable companies? Plus I did not need the cable card any longer, another expense. Okay, back to the review. I installed a GE Long Range HDTV antenna that I purchased at. The next product in our list is. Channel Master Amplify. The heavy duty construction of the Channel Master Amplify Plus makes it perfect for those who live in harsh climates. 
Its frequency-specific inputs let you separate VHF and UHF signals, while a switch allows you to modulate the intensity of the amplification. The price is around $98, check out the product link in the YouTube description below. This product is rated with 3.7 stars from 49 customer reviews, a customer said. I have four high power channels and one low power channel available. I need the NBC low power channel for a couple of Packer games. For my TV I had strong signal on the high power channels and next to nothing on the low power channel. I installed the channel master preamp in my basement not on the mast as recommended so if I needed to adjust gain I didn't need to climb a ladder. Before I installed the preamp the high power channels were 98 one hundredths on my TV's signal strength meter and the low power channel, no signal. On. Another happy customer said. For a few years I had a cheap generic brand preamp setup that died. Installed this last fall and it makes a tremendous difference in signal and channels brought in. Very good. The only downer is the adjustment is outside behind the cover on the box on the mast, and it only has low and high. Not a huge deal, and it works. The next one is. Channel Master Titan 2. If you are more than 80 miles away from a broadcast tower, the Channel Master Titan 2 can help you pick up those distant television signals and improve your viewing experience. It also has a built-in FM trap control to prevent radio signal interference. This product is available on Amazon for $75, check out the link in the YouTube description. The average rating of this product is 3.7 stars with more than 801 customer reviews, a customer said. I rejected this amp over a year ago as being too potent. Went with a lower gain Weingard unit with more overload resistance instead. That was a mistake. Even though every textbook over the last hundred years would have suggested otherwise. We have a decent 70 mile Yagi, but it's mounted within our attic. All calculations showed it should be fine for our easy single direction install. Unfortunately, Two of our channels had sporadic problems where the digital decoders within our solid-state HD home run tuners would glitch, yielding TS files which were often unrecoverable. We had fallen of the. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below, so if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.